What's up everyone? Welcome back to my channel. I am Marco Chinoco. I am Marcelo Garcia Black Belt, five-time world champion, big us. And today's lessons, I'm here with Miss Lila. Miss Lila is gonna help me out today with the video, some with cool uh, uh, concept and cool games for you guys to train at home, train at the gym, to uh, make your, uh, yourself more confident, help your child, your kids to train jiu-jitsu. So, so I hope you guys at home, uh, anywhere, and uh, watch this video and inspire you guys to start training jiu-jitsu, right, Lila? Because yeah. jiu-jitsu is very fun, right? Yeah. So what jiu-jitsu teach you? Teach you how to be self-confident, right? To what you have to deal with, like uh, for example, uh, if someone push you at, at school, like the bullies, right? So jiu-jitsu teaches you how to be, how to stand for yourself and give you confidence, right? So for example, let's do a test. What happens if someone pushes you at the school? What you gonna tell them? Like you just say, leave me alone. Yes, leave me alone. And look in their eyes and look very serious. Being like angry and say, leave me alone. And leave me alone, that's correct. Okay, so are you ready to start? Yeah. Okay, so today guys, we're gonna teach you guys a little bit uh, how to control, how to get the isometric training where you control, you have where you, you, Working your grips, right? So one of my favorite way to warm up, get that, that strength going, especially for the, the, the little ones, right? So we're gonna help, the first one we're gonna start how to climb a tree, which is like very uh, good for the kids that you can play at home, you can put your top jacket on it and help them be very strong and get into the game, right? So why like that demonstrate for us? Okay, like, so we're gonna start right here where you're gonna have a good uh, good balance, right, squatting down, and Lila gonna come with the hands right on my collar, right here, go slow, Lila, hold it, number one grip, number two grip, and then Lila gonna go uh, and put a foot on it, go hold tight, Lila, and climb up right here, put the foot right here, Lila, put the foot right here, and then put the foot right there, and now stay right here, where the challenge is, kids love challenge, right? So Lila, your challenge is go under my arms, okay? Go for it. Go under, climb, go touch, under. I can't touch the ground because there's alligator. That's there. right. You cannot touch the ground because there's alligator right there so we can make more fun. Keep going, Lila, keep going, Lila. Keep going, Lila. And she's going around and she can put the both hooks in on the back, right? So we can put seat belts and you can hang out right here for a little bit and get them holding as tight as they can like a backpack. Right, it's very uh, fun windy. for them. It's very windy. You can play around, so they can climb in the tree. Now it's gonna be a little bit windy, where they have to hold on tight. Of course, you hold your elbows and hold tight, hold tight, hold tight. Whoa, give it that little shake, right? And then make sure you always keep fun for them. Like they climb the trees, right? So they're actually training, like their grip, taking the back, right? And now Lada gonna <laughs> come back to the tree. And keep going under my arm, right, Lila? Lila cannot fall because there is shark on it, right? So come up, come up, come up, come up. Focus, focus, focus. Build up, build up, build up, build up. You help them out just like this, naturally, right? So this is not planned. So Lila did really good. If they fall down, make sure you hold them up. It's like every time they're holding, they're working really hard. Okay, Lila, come back. So those are the... These are the, the climbing the tree, where it's one of my favorite ones to build their confidence. You can build up, uh, uh, you can put them line up, right? You can work with your coaches, your instructors, or even at home with your father or your, your parents. You can stand right there and help them climb the trees, which is really good. Really high five. Okay, so this next game here is like very educational game, which I really like and get them to memorize uh, 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 the movement. When you come to Jiu-Jitsu class, and they're like, okay guys, let's do a double leg, take down, and do this, that. They don't translate the way we, the way we think. So the best way is to name uh, uh, something fun for them. In this one, we're gonna learn how to double leg take down for us, but here's a challenge, Lila. There's a zombie that you have to take them down. Okay, so how does zombie looks like? Zombie could look like this, right? Walking around. And then what Lila gonna do? Lila gonna push them up, okay? So you tell the, the, the your child, your kids, 
You're gonna push your arm up, drop to the knees, and hold behind the knee, tackle the zombie. So it's gonna be like this. Walk, walk, zombie, ladder, gonna push my arm up, go ladder, push my arm up, push, drop it, and then hold behind the knees, right? Which like she push right there, and then she push down. And boom. And then, move back a little bit. I lock in my guard where I lock my legs, which is my guard. The zombie is gonna do this. Now the zombie can hold by the collar, right? So what the child had to do? You're gonna free one hand, go free one hand, Lila. Yeah, push one, push two. Now she needs to get out the guard, which push the leg, push the leg, boom, 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 tiptoe. Like I would say, tiptoe, push the leg down, circle around, boom, 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 boom. And then mount, mount. And then from here, hold it, one, two, three, four, Pass, nice. Let's do it again. So, Lada, the zombie come to you. You're gonna push on real quick. Push, 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 and go. Push, push arm up. Boom, push, nice. Boom. The zombie locking a guard where he gonna hold the collar. Move this way. Where Lada posture up. Show the camera very nice. Where you're gonna free one hand at a time, holding. Pull one, two, and a push. Circle around. Tip toe, tip toe, tip toe, tip toe, and then go to mount. Boom! When you go to mount, I'm gonna bridge. Lada gonna hold my neck, and then she gonna switch side. One, two, three. Now the zombie gonna try push Lada up. Where Lada gonna swim under, and boom! One, push, 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 and two, and then on three. Ah, uh, boom! The zombie kill the zombie. Go back fast. Now those are very good for kids to understand the concept of grappling where you push them up, tackle as a double leg, and then it's amazing. So it's called a zombie game where you have to take the zombie down. Excellent, okay? So in this next one, what are we gonna do? We're gonna teach your child at home, at, at the gym, uh, learn how to grappling without realizing they are training, okay? So in this one, what are we gonna do? We're gonna say, hey Lila, I'm gonna have this ball, and the rules of this, of this grappling is you have to pass number one level, you have to pass off my legs to get the ball, but the rules is you have to get to mount, right? So I'm gonna be here. So number one level, level one. Like try to pass the leg, boom, 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 boom. Press the leg, push, push, push. Boom, get to mount, get to mount. Boom, get to mount. Once you get to mount, and then she'll be able to grab the pineapple. The pineapple and pull and say, Hooray! Hooray! That's right, so let's go back. Let's do it again. So level one, level one, I'm gonna be here. We're gonna grab, we'll learn how to grappling, right? So let's go ladder, push the leg, push the leg, boom, boom, boom. Mount, 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 mount. Pass, 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 and then pull the arm down, pull the, pull the pineapple, and pull. Hooray! Okay. Nice, go back, good. So that's level one for the grappling game. Okay, level two of the grappling, Lila gonna be in my guard. So I'm gonna let your child in the guard. So now the rules is, she needs to open up. Stay sit still. She needs to, one arm, I'm holding the, the pineapple, I like to count as a pineapple, forgot to mention. I have this pineapple because it's sticking their mind, so I have to go around and get a pineapple. Now this one where I'm gonna hold one collar and hold the pineapple, the rules now is, you, you explain to your child, the rules now are you have to free one grip, to get this pineapple, you need to break the grip, open the leg, look, I will associate getting out the leg, tiptoe, 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 boom, 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 and then mount. Once you get them out, she gonna grab the pineapple, the rules is your knee has to be down and pull the pineapple up, let's go, pull. Hooray! Hooray! And close the guard, and the collar grip, where number one rules, pull the collar down, boom. Now, push the leg down, push, 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 boom. Circle around, circle around, like as quick as you can, boom, mount, mount, mount. Pull the knee down and pull the pineapple, pull it, both hands, boom. Oh, hooray! Hooray, that's it. So those are amazing for them to associate grappling in Jiu Jitsu. So I will guarantee to you guys that they're gonna do so well in the first couple of weeks using the ball and then eventually you take the pineapple out, and then, okay guys, let's start a close guard, push the leg down, stay here, push the leg down, and then pass to mount. 
which they are training. So those are a method that I really like to use with the youngest one, and they do super, super well. Need to be fun, okay? So now, Lana, this one here, we're gonna go call grappling from the top, where I have one arm, one ball here, which is the pineapple, and the grab right here. So Lana, to grab the pineapple, you have to feel this grip. What I'm gonna do here, boom, 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 push, 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 boom. Grab the ball, grab the pineapple, grab the pineapple, grab the pineapple, break, break, break. Boom, then learn how to break. Boom, break, and then grab the pineapple. Break, it, get the pineapple. Boom, both hands, boom. Now it's my turn where the child, right, my turn. And now like make grip on my collar. Yeah, it's like this, make grip, like this. Now she has one grip and protecting the pineapple. So now we learn a little bit how to grab her from the feet. Where I have to break this grip. Make so much fun for them, look, they love it. Break the grip and then grab the pineapple. I can't, so one arm protect, one arm fights. So now we learn how to grab for their feet as well. So those games are really good to do in your class and they're at home, trust me, works 100%. Now let's go into a game where I learned this from Coach Jerry, which he's helped me in the kids class. Amazing, amazing coach, he, he helps me a lot. And this game uh, uh, works really well for the younger, uh, I think too, for the youngest one and the oldest one because they love it. They want to have fun. They come to the class Jiu Jitsu to have fun. Okay? So, and then in the latest video, I'm going to show you how to prepare my class, which is going to be really helpful for you guys. And maybe, who knows, help you guys a lot out there, okay? But today we're just going to go a little bit of grappling video and a uh, couple games for you. So the number one game now, what are you gonna go here? Um, tag, the ball tag, which is this, right? Ball tag, where we cannot hit on the head, you cannot throw the ball, try hit, try touch on the shoulders over there. So we're gonna be running around the tag, right? Who know, everybody know how to play, uh, play tag. So now we're gonna do here, Every time we run around, run around, a bunch of kids run around, we can do this at home with the brothers and sisters. So we can run around, run around, and then I tag Lila, for example. Lila be here. When I tag Lila, boom, I tag Lila, let give the ball to her, and then she's gonna scream. I love the little. Yes, that's correct. So you raise your, uh, the ball up and say, I love Jiu Jitsu. That way you get the kids engaged with the group. And then we're going to run around, run around, and then, for example, let it tag me. I grab the ball, nice and loud, I love jiu-jitsu. So that way the kids have so much fun. Are you ready? Let's do it again. Boom, boom, we run around, run around, and then we tag Lada. We tag Lada, boom. She raised. I love jiu-jitsu. And then she goes to tag the other kids, which this game, the ball tag, is amazing. It's like a game change for your class. Trust me. Works all the time okay so let's go again so which which game do you like to show everybody out there um bulldog bulldog the bulldog probably you know but why not we're already here where bulldog. i'm gonna be running a lot, uh, around all the kids gonna be running around line gonna be the bulldog right so get down line. she's gonna be the bulldog and then she's gonna all the kids gonna run around go bulldog get the bulldog we're gonna go around we're gonna go around and then she tag me now I become the bulldog. And then we both are bulldogs to try to get everybody. Boom, 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 go around, go around. And then we tag them, okay? Tag. Now, one more game, okay? Number one was a, a, a little ball. bit of the, the dodgeball, yeah, next time. Today we're gonna show one more because it's too much information for them. So I'm gonna show you guys one really good game. It's gonna be the tag as well. But whoever has the ball, so for example, stand up loud. So give, uh, hold the ball. So now we gotta uh, hold, stay back. She's the, she's it. She's gonna try to tag everybody, which she's gonna tag me. And she's gonna run and then she tags me, right? She go there, Lila, tag me, go run. Go around, we run, we run, and then Lila go tag me and hold me the ball. So now I'm freeze. And the only way to unfreeze me, Lila has to do a super nice and slow double leg takedown. You got the idea? To unfreeze a friend, you need to do a double leg takedown. So I'm here freeze. What I'm gonna do, I'm gonna tuck my head and then anybody can come to the front, make sure you tell them 
who is around. And Lana gonna do a nice double leg where I like, go get your knees, drop your knees, hold behind the knees. And Lana to unfreeze me, she's gonna push me down. And boom, now run, run away, run away, run away. Boom, boom, boom. Now I'm on freeze and I'm gonna run around, so stay here. And then for example, I tag Lana, she's gonna hold the ball, tuck the chin in, and Lana's freezing, right? So hold the ball, Lana. Now any kids can come and practice the double leg takedown, where Lana gonna go here, yeah, when I go for the double leg, Lana, hold the ball, and then do a break fall with one hand. Go there, boom. Oh, and then she's on freeze to go around. So those games are, uh, these games are really good. Come up, lad, stay here for me. Those games, are, these games are really good because they have fun and they are training their takedown without knowing that actually a double leg takedown, okay? So those little bit of grappling game is just to help you guys out there. In, uh, in the future, I'm gonna be playing more videos like this. But I want to try to share with you guys uh, uh, because you guys had a lot of requests. You can sit down here. You guys had a lot of requests about uh, uh, tips to deal with the kids. Okay, so so I uh, uh, hope this video helped you guys. Okay, just for a little bit, and then I'm gonna do my best to help you guys there. So this channel is just to help you guys, adult kids. Is jiu jitsu anything that's related to jiu jitsu? I'm gonna try to bring to this channel to help you guys out. Okay, so. I hope you guys have fun and, and don't forget, I'm glad to stay here. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel and help me grow this. The more subscribers, the better for sure. And uh, don't forget to comment, send me a request. I will do my best to help you, okay? So if you guys want any, uh, uh, if you guys want to check it out, you know my instructionals at bjfanatics.com. So make sure you go there and, and, and check it out. There's a bunch of videos for you guys. And I'm gonna leave the link right in the description of this video, so make sure you check it out, okay? So thank you so much. Glad, there's anything else you wanna tell the kids out there? Anything no. that you wanna tell the kids? No. No? So high five, thank you so much. And we're gonna be doing a lot more videos like this, okay? Did you have fun? Yeah. You did a lot of fun, right? Seven and a half, yeah. So if you're together, right? Wanna say nice and loud, ready? Right?